We're following some breaking news out of Loudoun County, Virginia. We told you a short time ago that the jury in the Allen Coley trial has reached a verdict. The judge had sent the jury back. They have now returned. The jury found Coley not guilty on all but one count in the shooting of Tanner Cook at Dulles Town Center back in April. Yeah, Matthew Torres is live outside of the Loudoun County Courthouse. And Matthew, the jury was deadlocked before reaching this verdict, right? Yeah, which gave you an indication that this is no clear cut case earlier. They were really divided, but after they were instructed to go back to the jury room to continue deliberation, they came back about an hour and a half later, deciding that the defendant, Alan Coley, uh, was defending himself against the victim in this case, Tanner Cook. This is what they found him not guilty on two charges of aggravated, excuse me, one count of aggravated malicious wounding and the second count is on the use of a firearm for aggravated malicious wounding. What they did find him guilty on is the unlawful discharge of a firearm within an occupied building. After all, this was a shooting inside the mall. But the defense attorney is now asking for the judge to put that verdict aside until they can discuss it more during a hearing on October 19th. Again, what the jury essentially did was decide that he was defending himself. Throughout this entire week, the defense says that he was the one, Alan Coley, being threatened by 21-year-old Tanner Cook, who approached him at Dulles Town Center Mall uh, by playing a prank using Google Translate and playing a phrase on his phone, putting it near his face and continuing to play this joke as part of a prank video for his YouTube channel. And in the video that we saw that has yet to be made public, we heard Coley telling him to stop four times. Uh, the defense says he even threatened to call police before pushing that phone away. The Commonwealth during this entire time said that uh, Cook was not threatening, was not aggressive, did not pose a threat, and that he was simply playing a joke. And that by playing a joke, that should not have warranted Coley to pull out a gun and shoot him. Again, this verdict came down just about 30 minutes ago. I did talk with Tanner Cook and his mother as they stepped outside of this courthouse. We'll have a piece of their interview and their reaction on this coming up at 6. That's the latest here in Leesburg tonight. I'm Matthew Torres, WUSA 9.